Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. We're continuing with my balcony garden series today and you're seeing the second part from this year's gardening journey. It was still April when I set up this insect hotel and all the plants are growing slowly but surely with even the first blossoms showing on my Lunaria anna. I planted it last year as it blooms only in the second year and will show its true beauty later in the season. Of course I bought several new plants like this banana plant and this olive tree who like to be sprayed with water every now and then. The strawberry plants I planted in the last video were starting to bloom and I heard that you should cut off the first blossoms to encourage the plant to grow a little more instead of putting all its energy already into producing fruit. So let's see if it'll work. During every journey, errors are inevitable. I forgot to water the salad seedlings for a couple of days and so they dried out. My seedlings indoors, however, grew wonderfully, which you will see in these time lapses I made. It was so much fun making them, I think I should do that more often. More gardening chores included repotting some plants like the new banana plant. I used normal gardening soil and mixed in clay granulate. Afterwards, I planted this climbing variety of a strawberry in its new pot and built a trellis for it using bamboo sticks. For the strawberry, I used organic potting soil suitable for crops. Thank you. 
Another plant I bought, this time at the supermarket at a discount, was the cranberry plant which I'm still very excited about. I decided to plant it in one of my raised beds. New seeds were purchased and sold as well. I was very happy about these seeds. Bonnie grass, cosmos and cucumber. I sowed two rows of the latter and one row each of the other two because I wanted to plant a few of the cucumelon plants in one of my raised beds.
everything grew so well with the rising temperatures and the days getting longer. And soon I could divide and transplant a lot of the seedlings into bigger pots. Almost all of the pots and things I'm using here have been used multiple times. I even used the plastic packaging from some mochi I bought as a pot for some of the red basil seedlings. Together with its lid, it even functioned as a mini greenhouse. Look at my beautiful pumpkin plant. It is ready for a new pot. Earlier this year, I started some carrot seeds indoors and could plant them outside in April. I heard that you don't need to start carrot seeds inside, but I love seeing them grow. I kept them in my cold frame cabinet for a while to get them accustomed to the cooler temperatures in the night. I transplanted the seedlings into one of my raised beds and put them in between the bok choy and the salads. Afterwards, I transferred lots of tomato seedlings into bigger pots. I also made sure to write more tags to not forget which variety is which. I know this looks silly, but I even transplanted the bunny tail grass, which you saw me sowing early in the video. It grew so fast, but it looked a little scarce in the new pot, so I decided to plant some new seeds around the grass as well.
I bought this beautiful concrete urn in a variety store and I sincerely wish I had bought more of them because they are so pretty. And because I cannot get enough of the bunny tail grass, I quickly determined the urn as another pot for growing it. I have to keep an eye on watering carefully in this pot because it has no drainage hole. Here, I'm continuing with transferring tomato seedlings into bigger pots. Look at the amount of pots holding my seedlings now. I can't wait until they grow bigger. Let me also share some film photos from that time with you. Now we're already at the end of this video again, but don't be sad, the next part is coming soon. I promise to not keep you waiting for over a month again. Let me know about your gardening plants and plants in your garden this year. Also about some errors that occurred maybe? Let's chat in the comments. Thank you so much for watching. Take care and see you in the next video. Bye.